welcome back to my channel. I know this is totally different. This is not my camera. Um, I finished setting up all the lighting and everything and trying to get the right position and when I turned on my camera, it was dead and I can't film while it's charging because it's kind of a messed up camera. I'm changing my camera soon, but yeah, I'm using my iPad to film and I hope this is okay. It's a little bit too up close, but we'll do with what we have. All right, so I went to the Elf store. I finally made my way to Union Square, 14th Street area to go to the real the real real tail store of Elf Cosmetics. The only one that just opened and I picked up some stuff for my kid and for myself. Um, so let me just pull everything out of the bag. So their bag looks like this. This bag is kind of raggedy already. I had it sitting in my room to haul, so <laughs> it's not a fresh, clean bag, but yeah. Alrighty, so I picked up some liquid eyeliners. I love their black liquid eyeliner. It's really good for what it is. It's a really black look liner for a dollar, so that's why I love it. So I got three colors. I got black, of course. Then I got the brown, which is coffee. Then I got midnight. Is it? Does it look like I'm looking over there? Because that's where the camera is. Okay. Weird. Okay, this is midnight, which is blue. Then I got some eyelash curlers from my kit. I saw, let me tell you a funny story about this. When I saw that they have makeup remover exfoliating cleansing cloth, I was so excited. I was like, oh my goodness, they got exfoliating makeup wipes. I'm gonna buy me like all of them. So what I did was that I bought three of these. And I bought, I'm already using this. I am using the makeup remover cleansing cloth, the original one. This is 10 cloths, and this is 20. I didn't, I like, I didn't even take the size to consideration. Like, duh, this is 10, this is 20. I didn't even freaking see it. So I spent, and these were the same exact prices. So I'm getting half of what I could get with the regular cleansing cloths. So I was just like, I was annoyed. I was already on the train, like two steps, two stops away in the train. I was like, I was not going back. But um, if I go back, I'm gonna return these because they are good. It's just that I don't want to spend three dollars for ten cloths when I could spend three dollars for twenty makeup removers wipes. So yeah, and I love I love Elf Elf um, makeup remover cleansing gloss. They are great. They're saturated. They really clean off. Like I really love that for three dollars. I love this. So I got three of these. Like exfoliating cloths and then I got a baked highlighter what is with that piece of hair okay then I got a baked highlighter this is blush gems I got this from my kit I sure did this is how it looks I also got the HD Mattifying Cream Foundation. This is one of their new items. And I got the darkest color, which is Cocoa. That is how that looks. And it is, I tried it on at the store. And it's almost, it fits my complexion, but it kind of makes my face look lighter. So, I don't know. So this is how the packaging looks like. I could use, I still bought it because I could use this in my kit to contour with for other people. It's a deep brown color. It comes with a little puff on the bottom. And 
yeah so it has two this is the bottom this is the top it has a little mirror and that's what it is then I got some tweezers that I really really needed because um, I have individual lashes and I want to I can't do it with my hands so I need tweezers I couldn't find any so I just picked up tweezers and then I saw this brush I have a brush problem everybody knows this I don't need any more brushes but um I need more brushes for my kit honestly I do no I'm talking myself into buying more brushes no I don't really need brushes no Rachel you don't need any brushes um this is a stippling the small stipple brush and it looks like this and it's pretty dense I love this like I could use this for my under eye for everything else oh my god I love this this is so cute and small and itty bitty. I love it. And it feels so soft. I was in the store like filling all their brushes. They have their studio line brushes. They don't have their essential line brushes in the store, which was kind of like, really. I wanted to get some essential line brushes. I didn't even know that. And this is a regular size stippling brush, but it's dirty. So I use this for my foundation. Um, this is the regular size one. And this is the small one. I like this. Then I got Makeup Mist and Set. I felt this in the store. Like, I was like, ching, and it just felt like a nice, refreshing feel. So I was like, okay, I will get this for my kit. So I never opened this yet. Let me just pull it out. It's just a spray bottle. I think everybody's seen this. Okay, now I'm destroying the packaging. Okay, whatever. Um, <laughs> this is the bottle. And it's, it's, I like it. It's really good. It feels very refreshing, so I love that. The second blush I also got was, uh, it's not a blush, it's a baked highlighter. Did I say blush last time? These are baked highlighters. Um, this one is pink diamonds. It looks like this. And I just thought it was perfect for my kit on like um, lighter skin um, people. I think any, everybody can use this. It just depends on how much you apply on. But this was definitely a, a good thing to get for my kit. It's just a nice pink highlight. And let's swatch that. And that's it right there. And this is Pink Diamonds and Blush Gems. This is them side by side. So this is more of a brown and this is more of a pink. So yeah. It's hard to look that way. Because the camera, my iPad is horizontal, so it's like the it's like right there. I can't. I just can't. <laughs> Alright, um, let me open the eyelash curl so you can see how it actually looks. And it comes with a spare rubber thingy. So, this is how it looks. Looks pretty decent. I haven't tried their eyelashes. Eyelasher. Eyelasher? The eye curler. I never used it before. So, if you have, let me know what you think, how it used, how it, how it works. Does it, does it like, is it durable? Is it good? Let me know. So that is pretty much it for the haul. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, what is your favorite e.l.f. product? Like, my favorite e.l.f. product will probably be their powder brush because you, when I started out, I used that like all the time for my liquid foundation and it did a perfect airbrush finish and I love that brush. What else do I love? What's my top five favorite e.l.f. products? I don't know, you guys tell me in the, in the comments. But I think my top five would be the powder brush, the liquid liner in black. Um, what else? I like their false eyelashes. Um, what else? Uh, I know I'm blanking. I know there's another thing. Oh, their makeup wipes. I love that. Um, what's another one? Uh, I'm going the inner stippling brush. Their stippling brush. I love this. I remember switching over to this. Like I didn't even know what the heck to use with this. And I just used it one day and it just gave me a beautiful finish. And then I started to keep on using stippling brushes. I love their stippling brushes. So yeah, that's pretty much it for this video. I hope this came out right. Um, this is not my usual 
I hope the quality is good enough on my iPad. Um, yeah. This is just a one-time thing. I'm just going to hope my camera is working next time I do a video. So, yeah, that's pretty much it, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. Be sure to thumbs this up and share and subscribe and all that good stuff. And I'll see you guys in another video. Bye, you guys. So, yeah. That's... Oh, my God. I wish I could take pictures. <sighs> I can't. So gonna, the makeup is probably not even going to show through. Okay, why am I growling? Alright, um, yeah, that's pretty much it. So, yeah. Let me see if I can take pictures with my action camera. Bye, guys. I don't know how I forgot to put blush and contour. See? <sighs> okay. What am I forgetting? Nothing. Okay, bye.